Let's take a look at creating our very first animation. If we just want to create a very simple animation, we can try to use the animation wizard. It's just a very fast and easy way to generate some quite simple animations. I go within my motion manager here and go to this icon here. And that's my animation wizard. So I can just click on that. And we have a couple options that the wizard can help us with, all for fairly simple animations. So if we just want to do a simple rotation of the model or uh, explode or uh, collapse, something simple like that, we can do really just with the click of a button using the animation wizard here. So let's first start just a rotation of my model here. And I can click next. And all I have to do is define which axis I'd like to revolve about. So whether it be the X axis, the Y axis, the Z axis. In this case, maybe I'll choose the Y axis. Which direction, clockwise or counterclockwise, and how many rotations. Let's say maybe two in this case. And again, click next. Then finally, once I've defined which axis to rotate about and how many rotations to perform, just give the duration of my animation. So start time, maybe I'm gonna start at zero seconds. And duration, maybe I'm gonna say rotate twice uh, within eight seconds. And then once I'm happy with all of these settings, I can just click finish. And notice here, it's just automatically created all the key points required for this simple animation. So I can try to just play. So I can hit the play button or the calculate button. And I can see my rotation within my very simple animation here. Generally, I suggest using the calculate button when it's your first time running through an animation to calculate all the new geometry changes and everything like that. And then once you've run through one calculate, you can just click the standard play button. So here we see a very, very simple animation of just rotating around twice.